What's up, folks? It's Erin here, bringing you a little update for this week. I know it's a day late, but I had to take a day off yesterday because I really am enjoying my weekends. So there you have it. It's Monday. Happy Monday. Uh, happy Caffeine Day for anybody who hasn't checked it out. I just posted a hilarious video of myself uh, dancing jacked up on caffeine. So you are welcome for that caffeine meditation. Uh, this week, okay, what's happening this week? What is happening this week? Of course, uh, I made a big announcement this this week about the May 1, May 1st, mark it down, the half-day mindfulness retreat that I'm hosting. And so May 1st, it's going to start at 9.30 Eastern Standard Time. It's going to run till about 1 p.m., so you're not going to be on Zoom all day long. It is a virtual hangout, uh, a virtual learning space, a virtual healing space, um, but I don't want to keep you indoors all day. So May 1st, mark it down. Uh, there's a lot more information in the email that is below, but um, hit me up if you want more information on that. And if you want to save about 40% off of the ticket price, send me a DM or just simply go to the link to sign in and type in the coupon code, all in caps lock, may one reawaken. That is right. May you reawaken. May one reawaken, all in caps. And you will save 40% off of this ticket price for the early bird. Okay, so... It's only, that coupon code is only valid until April 23rd. Get it, get it, get it, get it. All right, so May 1st, retreat signed up for. Next item of business. This Wednesday, I am hosting Dr. Christina Bjorndahl. She's a naturopathic doctor in Alberta. She is well, well known in this, in the naturopathic field for her treatment for folks with mental health disorders. Um, she actually recently wrote a book and I recently read her book called Beyond the Label, which is a beautiful, beautiful intimate account of her own struggles with mental health, with bulimia, with uh, anxiety, depression, suicide, and psychosis, and getting diagnosed with uh, bipolar type 1 disorder. It is beautiful. I highly recommend that book. And also, if you want to come face-to-face -face and sit with Dr. Christina, I would love to have you on Wednesday for the Inspiring Insights podcast recording. This is episode 31 this week. So, oh, it's it's going to be brilliant. It's going to be so good. We're going to learn a lot of things. She's going to teach us about her own story, yes, but also, you know, the top four aspects to address in your overall health during this pandemic what actually supporting the physical health means to you while supporting your mental health, um, your own need to know steps in tackling your mental, emotional, spiritual body, how to really trust and learn from your own intuition. And of course, we'll, we'll end with a little Q&A with Dr. Chris. So that's on Wednesday. It'll be 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Sign up at the link below. And also the link is in my bio on Instagram. 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. 4 p.m. Mountain Standard Time. If you're tuning in from Alberta. If you're fans of uh, your naturopathic doctor there. Dr. Christina Bjorndahl. So that'll be amazing. Um, just dropping in. Friday, of course, we have our den meeting it's a virtual mindfulness space as well just for an hour at the drop-in space we do a lot of visualization there a lot of conversation there just bringing up what you know maybe people are coming into the room with and um, and just honoring folks where they're at and being together in space over a virtual campfire so that's the den i would love to have you you can drop in and uh, just check it out on my website the aaron edwards.com slash the dash den I should take the, the dash out but whatever <sighs> anyway uh, lots of lots of great things you can be availing of this this week especially when it's raining you know April showers bring May flowers maybe April mindfulness brings May mindfulness <laughs> uh, 
uh, that's about it for today. I thank you so much for being here, for being alive, for being invested in your own health and for allowing me to be here on your journey with you. I, I appreciate that. I really, really honor you. And I, and I honor the position that I'm in as a guide and a leader in this field. So thank you. That is it for this week of April 12th. I love you. See you hopefully on Wednesday, on Friday, or on May 1st. May 1 Reawaken.